So I'm going to say, dear Netflix. Well, hello there and welcome back to the uh, awkward corner. Um, first things first, let me do my annual, uh, sorry for not making a video for ages, but that's done. Right. First things first, before I get straight into this video, can I please say, uh, if you'd like to, please give a little like on this video, if you like, don't have to, and also if you could subscribe, that would be great as well. Next up, you might also notice I'm holding this very thing. It's actually my microphone. Uh, usually I've got it attached to something, but this time I don't, so I'm holding it. So if you see this, it's because you need good audio, right? To make a good video, you need good audio, so that's what we're having. Now on to the main topic, uh, if you didn't know, if you haven't watched any of my other videos, it's fine, hello, welcome if you're new, um, you might know that I am a fan of a lot of things, but one of the things mainly being Hannibal. Now this show finished five years ago in 2015 and uh, started in 2013, now it's, it's an old show, sort of, I hate saying that, but it is an old show. And um, I'm one of those people, I'm a fanable, as they say, and uh, I'm one of those people who, who want to see it back because it really is a great piece of television. It, it's not even just that it's a piece of television, it's that it's, you know, amazing. <laughs> and that it's so cinematographically, is that a word? Cinema, cinematographically? Cinem yeah, the cinematography? Is that right? Cinematography. Sorry, I keep getting distracted by the lovely picture of Millie behind me. Oh, hey, Mel. Anywho, if you didn't know, recently they did, on Nerdist, a Hannibal reunion where all of the cast, except from Lawrence Fishburne, um, was there and they all had this big interview, including the creators, uh, Brian and Martha was there. So it was like, oh my gosh, it was like a Fannibal's dream. <laughs> and if you didn't know, Fannibal is the term that they give for the fans of Hannibal. Now, my main thing of this video is the title is going to be, I've, I've already thought of it in my brain, is going to be Dear Netflix. So I'm going to say, Dear Netflix. <laughs> you need to bring back Hannibal. Now, I'm not just saying this because I know a lot of people, I know a lot of accounts on Twitter because I love scrolling through Twitter and seeing all the other fanables and stuff. Um, but uh, we all like go after Netflix, like Netflix, please. <laughs> and now that they have brought it into America, like it's very much like Netflix now, please. So it's, it's very much Netflix is the place to be right now because they brought it back. And actually, if you didn't know, Netflix did originally want to pick it up after it was cancelled by NBC. However, due to wordy stuff, they couldn't. So now's its chance, now that it has it in America. Ooh, ooh, ooh. They've been, they've been sort of flirting, flirting? Yeah, they've been flirtatious, especially Mads Mikkelsen's account on Twitter. It's been quite flirtatious and so is, um, the Netflix fan account, uh, Netflix Life, I believe, has been sort of like flirting with the idea of season four, very much with the fans. They've been saying, ooh, is there gonna be a season four now that they bought it? So it's, I think it's going to happen, but not yet. And, uh, even on this interview, like, Mads was down, they were all down, even Brian, it was like so excited. I loved seeing Brian's, um, like, excitement over the idea of season four like they were so ready for it and i think i think it's gonna happen so dear netflix please 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 let this happen because you would make some very happy fans including myself in including the cast and do you know what if you haven't realized by now it's already trending on netflix in america because of how excited the fans are and even new fans now heck i've even got my dad into hannibal i've even got my cousin into hannibal because she's a huge fan of killing eve which will definitely be a, another episode of the awkward corner where i talk about killing eve because yeah killing Eve's amazing but this isn't about killing eve this is about hannibal just saying but yes dear netflix please make this happen 
I genuinely think Hannibal was way before its time. Um, as I said, with with all the like the aspects and the different themes that they brought up is so relevant now. It wasn't really relevant back then. So I think now is the best time. It's it's timeless. You you watch it now, and you would think it was made very recently. To think that it was made eight five years ago. Do you know what I mean? It's it's literally like it's great great. It's crazy. So Netflix, if you have a brain cell, please bring it back for season four. That's all we ask. Thank you. Uh, so thank you very much everyone for watching. I know I've already asked before, but if you would like to comment, I do read them. I do read them. Yeah. Uh, if you'd like to comment and uh, leave a like and stuff, that'd be great. If you'd like to subscribe, that'd be cool. You don't have to. And uh, ding, ding dong, the, the bell dong. The bell dong. <laughs> And don't forget to stay weird, stay awesome, and stay awkward. <laughs>